All right. All right. <laughs> Welcome back to Adam vs. Joel. This is the KSP Fastest to Orbit Challenge. Who are you? I am not Joel. I am Adam. I look kind of like this dude. But since he looks like that dude and that dude, you can just imagine me however you want. Let's get started. Adam! Oh, you don't have a flag. Oh, but we're not planting a flag. We're not planting flags yet. You can use a Joel flag. I'm using a trees flag. I don't know why. Difficulty. Normal. Normal. Start. I take that back. I'm not going to use the pause. It's back and forth. It's fine. <clears throat> Thanks, I've got it. All right. Let's go into the vehicle assembly building. Got it. Go away tutorials. It is a manned flight, so we got to start with command pod. Let's put that up there. I watched Joel's <laughs> video and took some internal notes. I have an idea. I'm going to need to be able to control this thing in space. Is that the right size? Yeah, that's the right size. All right. Just an admin note here, if you could ditch the watch, I'm trying to keep my laptop from getting scratched up. <laughs> Alright. <clears throat> Joel has a very nice laptop. I have a nice laptop too, but it's been to uh, several third world countries and does not function at this moment. Alright, so... I have not played and many moons as well. I did some practice runs at home. We want that engine with that fuel tank. You don't want the uh, three and a half to two and a half adapter fuel tank? I don't even know where that is. It's in the fuel tanks. In the fuel tanks? Fuel tanks. Reach down. Oh no. Yeah, I know. I don't know. One of those. There's no three. I and usually half. sort it by mass. Yes. Let's see. Those are the little ones at the top now. Little ones. So resort by mass and put the big ones at the top. Big ones. There we go. Oh, no, you found it. I found it. I found it. This will probably be left on the editing floor anyway. See, I don't like that. It's not. It's not round, it's squared on one side. Whatever. Alright, so there's that. It looks kind of Saturn y. Like the Saturn V. <clears throat> yeah, kinda. Let's Ish. see. Let's zoom out a little bit. And we want some coupling. Coupling, there's a coupling. Radio. We want space. I saw Joel having some issues with his space. Let's turn on some symmetry. So I don't know if I should be helping you, but a pro tip I found during my uh, computer crash uh, drunken mooner challenge was putting the decouplers really low on the, uh, the main portion of the, or on the main stage of the rocket. Yeah, so that they had less chance of impacting. Yeah. Why are those not going straight? There we go. That looks straight. So, let's just go big or go home. Twin bore. That's what I want. Ooh. 
Yeah, that's not gonna work. I think low will be right. It has all the engines. <laughs> but not yet. You're still set up for four times symmetry. Yeah. I want to get under. All the engines. Damn! Let's give it some uh, aerodynamics. Nose cones. And let's asparagus stage. I wish they had uh, asparagus nose cone fuel tanks. That would be helpful. I guess if you wanted, I don't want symmetry. I want to do this manually. I guess I don't get to do it manually. Yeah, you just have to delete that. There. Give me that. Alright, you're gonna feed over there. You're gonna feed to there. And you're gonna feed to there. You're gonna feed there. Yeah. That's, uh, that's one way to do it. <laughs> I don't know if that's the right way to do it, but that's one way to do it. Man, that's ugly fuel lines. No! Undo. My Microsoft Office skills are paying off. That's a little better. All right, we can call that attempt one after we fix our decoupling. All right, so this one and this one need to fall off first. So which one are you? That one. So, engine, all the engines. Those, yep, that's backwards. We want that down there. And this here. All right, those will fall off and those will fall off. And I'm not balanced at all, so I'm gonna add some structural support. Stability enhancers. Symmetry, please. Let's see, you know what, I have very little directional. Let's give some winglets. I don't know how much that's going to help, but we'll see. Alright, we'll call that the beast. Mark one. Wait, Roman numerals. I did the same thing. Save and Who's flying it? Launch. I don't know. I didn't I didn't choose a crew member. Jebediah. I use Valentina, so she might be biased toward me. Yeah. You got luck with the ladies. Damn right. Let's go with Jebediah. Alright, save and launch. And we are wobbly. on the surface. Ooh, yeah, that's very wobbly. I'm gonna need to add some struts to that. But we're here, let's see what we got. Check our staging, all that looks good, that's good. SAS, full throttle, and away we go. Tell 
they're out of fuel. And we're reaching 9,000 meters. I'm going to start my gravity turn. That's some serious velocity. Yeah, we're about to lose our second stage. <laughs> you can tell <laughs> when they're gone. Let's turn over. 35,000 meters. Keep turning. Apple App says, geez, 350. I think we can safely turn. Let's see if we can't get an orbital vector. An orbital solution. Look at that periapside. Negative 300. Yeah, I'm just going to burn towards the planet now. See if I can't kill that. It's going to be close. 114. <laughs> One, first attempt, 114. <coughs> Yours was... Uh, 117. 117. I think I could do better than that if I had some more stability. But I am almost bingo in fuel. Let's see the, uh, the orbit. That's a good looking orbit, too. That's, that's a pretty good looking orbit. 94 and 68. That'll get you to the moon. Or the moon. You want to try to get to the moon from there? Uh, I, don't I, don't have, I don't have enough fuel for that. <laughs> so, I'll take the Delta V left. Delta V. Where's your Delta V meter? Vessel meter? tab. Vessel. And kill your orbit tab. Orbit off. Delta V. Seven, uh, 673. That's That would be cutting it close. So, uh, you wouldn't come back. Yeah, that would be a one-way trip. Unless you did an orbit with a free return. Yeah. And even that, I don't think you can make it. No. I think I can do better than that with uh, with some stability. Revert the flight. Vehicle launch assembly. Well, that was a weird intro to uh, the launch pad, but I'll take it. All right, staging still good. I have to check my staging every time because every time I build a new ship, my staging is always bad. SAS on full throttle and. Launch. Let's see if we can get any better. I started turning over at 9,000 meters or so last time. Let's, <coughs> let's start that turn a little bit earlier this time. Let's see if we can't get a lower apple lapse. Oh man, I wasn't paying attention to my first stage. Oh, that's the wrong way. Why am I on the wrong way? No. Yep. I hit something. No, I think something just... I hit that button. Ah. My camera, but east in reality. The ball was off. Because, yeah, like, when you press on I D, go that way. you go east. You were pressing on <coughs> D, right? Yeah, I thought yeah. I was. I don't know. It was a camera. All right, let's try this again. This time I'll pay attention to my staging... And hopefully we'll get better than 114. Let's do it. Orbits don't have to be pretty, they just have to be stable. Ish. Ish. Yeah, my Apple App side is falling. No, oh, it's climbing again. What's going what's going on? Yeah, it's not gonna beat my last run. That was a good run. My peri app side is Yay! And I don't know I don't know what happened there, but my my Apple Apps was climbing and my peri apps was 
dropping, even though it was pointed at the planet. But revert to assembly. <clears throat> I'm gonna check the delta V on this to start with. Seven million. It gives me three different stages, so thirteen. I mean, three thousand one hundred seventy-four. Let's get the total at the bottom. Does it? Oh yeah, there delta V five thousand three hundred and four. Dude, you should be able to get to Elu with that. All right. Let's get this over here where I can. Staging. Yes. Good, good, good. All right. This, I predict, will burn up before orbit. But let's find out. Full throttle. Go! Fourteen. One thirteen. One thirteen. 113. We improved by a second. Yeah. Let's look at that hideous, hideous orbit. <laughs> Come on, show it to the people. Yeah. I, all right, it's not... It's pretty bad. It's bad, but it's workable. Like, you could... You could... I mean, if I was trying to exit the planet, I could, uh, I could probably get a, a rendezvous from there with the Mun. How much fuel you got left, Delta B wise? Delta, uh, no, you want to burn periops to exit, don't you? Um, not necessarily in this situation. It depends on where your descending node is, and depends on how much fuel you have. But Delta V total six hundred and seventy nine. Could be worse. Do you mind if I try to get to the moon with what you got left? No, absolutely. All right. All right. So Joel is gonna take over controls. I am the orbit commander. He is the moon commander. I don't I don't think it's doable, but I kind of want to try. 